Transportation in the United States has a large impact on our environment in a number of ways. What efforts do you support to reduce the impact of transportation on our environment? Would you support legislation that creates incentives for cleaner, more efficient cars? If so, what kind of legislation would you support? Representative Mattel? Well, I think there's um, so obviously a number of different things they're trying to do with vehicles, obviously, nowadays, and whether it be, um, as it was in the article today, about biofuel using a certain percentage of that in, um, you know, in cars and oil. And I think that's the right way to go. I really do believe that. I know there's been some, um, you know, obviously great work in the area of electric cars and reducing and uh, minimizing the amount of gas we use. Because, I, again, I go back to the fact that, you know, the reasons why we're having problems over in the Middle East is because of our, our basically, you know, we're relying on their oil over there. And, you know, as long as we can continue to get away from that step by step you know, over the next 20 or 30 years, I think it's important to do that. And I think that, um, you know, when you look at uh, transportation, it's a huge, huge issue. All the, um, you know, the fossil fuels being burned and the carbon that's going up into our atmosphere. Obviously, you know, there's been some great debate with Al Gore's, um, you know, movie about, um, you know, the ozone layer and, and the ice caps melting. I think this all ties them together. And, you know, I think these are big issues and I think that they're important issues. So, you know, I think that it makes sense to uh, begin to get away from using diesel fuel and, and gas.